I'm putting this story out there because I'm hoping someone may find it and have an idea of what has happened. First, I am curious about the ability to make music into one physically ill or manipulate someone subconsciously. But even more, I want to know why it occurred in this case. It all started with a birthday gift. I have a friend, Angela Chong, whose birthday was coming up. I wanted to get her something nice, but my lack of personal f fun organization left me scrambling. Unfortunately, we live in a world of modern technology. I logged on and did a quick search. I had one good idea, and eBay was there to deliver. Angie is a big fan of K-pop, and her favorite music group was Red Velvet, which also happens to be my favorite cake kind of cake. Well, you can find songs and albums on digital media r relatively easily. The physical albums usually have a special editions like posters and books, not to mention about collecting values. And I was pleased to find a Red Velvet Summer Magic album for a much cheaper price than most of the other listings. It also happened to be a special Kang Sul Jai edition, which was Angie's favorite member the summer magic album was released with multiple versions a regular edition and one for each member with special member editions for being limited in release i immediately ordered the album and hoped it would arrive in time it arrived in the morning of her birthday by no means a guarantee with the postal service the album was new and un unopened just like the listing has promised i wrapped it up and delivered it by hand. Angie wasn't having a party until the weekend, but I wanted to deliver the gift on her birthday. Besides, she wanted to pres she want presents at her birthday at her birthday party. She was quite happy with the gift, so happy she hugged me, which meant she was very excited. Happy that the gift was had been also well received, despite nearly forgotten to, forgetting to do anything at all. I returned home with the with the light step and played video games till late. The next few days, I didn't have much contact with Angie, but arrived at her birthday party, at her birthday party, do ready to play games and get hammered. After about half an hour of losing friendships over video games and drinking some beer, I made my way to find another drink. I skipped over the peppermint snap snaps. Because who wants to drink alcohol that tastes like candy canes and tried to decide if I want vodka or not? Angie walked in and pulled me outside. Tim, I know this might sound strange, but where did you get that album you gave me? Same place. We got get anything nowadays. The internet. She rolled her eyes. What's wrong with it? It looked new. If it wasn't new, someone did a very good job re repackaging it. Then what's the problem? I was very excited. I'm sure you could tell. I nodded. Well, let's, I listened to the album like seven times. I don't remember falling asleep, but I w awoke in my bed. I was reading before, but I didn't have the book with me anymore. But when I tried to use my laptop, it had a bunch of viruses. I had to take it to a computer repair shop to get it fixed. They were able to get it yesterday and said the reason I had all those viruses I had was that I was browsing shady websites on the dark web without proper protections. Angie, you barely know how to use Google. How did you, you get it on the dark web? I don't know. That is what I'm wondering. I was using the computer to play the disc because no one uses the CD players anymore. So you think the CD had virus, had a virus or something? Maybe, but I can't use that computer repair place. What sort of places did you go on the dark web? She gave me a look. I'm just curious what the government watch list you are on now. Well, I have a list of names, but most of them are pretty vague, and almost all of them are in Korean. Huh. Well, I have some knowledge of computers. Maybe I could take a look at the disks. Sure, be careful. I'm sorry my gift backfired. I thought I got a great deal. 
the booklet and the poster just seems to be fine. No m weird mutilated pictures or creepy eyes. Good, good. Now I have to go crush Carlos and Hitomi and get drunk. Not necessarily in that order. Speaking of which, who brought the schnapps? It's gross. I like the schnapps. It tastes like candy canes. Whatever. I'll go, I'll sh make sure to get the albums before I leave. I forgot to the album for the rest of the party. Uh, though, I didn't end up drinking quite as much as I planned. I was going to walk home, but I was tipsy enough to that I accepted a ride from Carlos to my house. I collapsed into bed and woke up late in the next day. It was a bit rough the next day, but I felt better by that evening. I had several errands to run, and it wasn't wasn't it wasn't until after supper that next day I got around the uh, to the album again. The first thing I did was pop the disc into an old computer that wasn't connected to the internet. The tracks popped up in several media players and played without them, without problem. There didn't seem to be anything besides the audio tracks. I moved to a disc to a newer computer that was connected to the internet and there was still no virus or strange effect. I ran the tracks through a few programs and didn't notice anything. Having reached by the end of my abilities, I decided to ask a friend of mine who did a lot more audio mixing and computer stuff to look into the disc. He agreed to pick it up the next day. There's something else I need to get off my chest. I'm not really a K-pop fan, though some of the songs are pretty catchy, but listening to the tracks, trying to figure out what was going on, I started to enjoy them. I put the disc into an old CD player that was still kicking around and put it on a repeat and then got to work on my other hobby, painting miniatures. I got deep into the painting before I knew it. Several hours and good many repeats later, I woke up in the bathtub. It was a surprise to me as two. I, uh, though I would have blacked out drinking at least once, it felt like that, not only because of the vomit all over me in the toilet and on the kitchen floor, I felt very sick. I it took quite a bit of effort to come vertigo and got out of the tub. Having been very drunk the, just the night before, I know what a hangover is like, and this was different. I traced my steps back through my apartment, finding chips scattered to the floor and several par partially drunk glasses of milk and one spilled one. There were books and comics, comic books scattered all over the table that had not been the pr there before my bedroom their mo the models i had been painting were still sitting on the desk undisturbed and organized the cd player was knocked out on the ground and the red velvet cd has been broken into seven pieces and when i tried to put them together there was at least one piece missing i haven't found it yet but that wasn't a surprise, as it was quite small. Due to whatever happened, further investigation of the disc is impossible. The next couple of nights, I had very strange dreams. Nothing specific, but I can remember just a f strange feeling off when I woke up, and memories of seeing of strange twisting blackness in limbs and faces I don't mo that don't move and look right. And I guess that is everything. I got the list from of sites from Angie and just managed to translate the names, and I'm not sure what they are. And I don't feel like trying to visit them myself. Even with pre precautions, they have names like Green Dragon, Jeju, Fantasy Leg, and Bad March Mushrooms. I'm curious if any of you has similar experience with other music albums or gone sick from music, but I think there is something here. I don't know what was what it is and if you're wondering i bought angie the full da digital album it doesn't make people sick so you could face safely listen to all the red velvet you want without a problem